we've been debuting a lot of finest players in the past couple videos. Like, the first one we did was Tatis, Soto, and Burns. Then we did Kyle Tucker, Emmanuel Classe, uh, Brandon Crawford, Brian Reynolds, Sandy Alcantara. Now we're going to do another pitcher. This one is going to be Garrett Cole from the Yankees. He is the Yankees' uh, finest card from Team Infinity. So he's got a four-seam slider, knuckle curve, changeup, and a sinker. He does not have outlier on that fastball or the sinker. So I'm not really sure how I'm going to do. And he has 104 hits per nine, which is pretty low at this point in the year. I'm not really sure, but he does have a nice five-pitch selection. Um, we'll see. Maybe we, if we can go five innings with Cole, um, that would be uh, helpful. All right, found a game. Let's see. Who are we taking on here in this one? We are facing, okay, DeGrom. Parallel 5, Kevin Kiermeyer. Factor 71 degrees here at game time. Lifted into the air oh, damn. Center field. Looking up is the Wait, that ball's field. gone? Still going back. Gone. Oh, I thought I so missed it because Matty V heading. said, like, you know, lift it out to center field. I'm like, oh, he's going to catch that. I missed it. But, okay, Willie Mays going deep. And there's ball okay, he's going three pitches hey, on the uh, inside. I almost said outside. But inside, he hasn't gotten anything middle, hasn't gotten anything on the outside, low and away. It's been all inside. All right, here we go. All right, ball four. Dude, no fastballs of Soto in that at-bat. It was all breaking pitches. Slider, changeup, curveball, no fastballs. This guy is such a good hitter. He doesn't care. Crawford, deep right field. Let's go. Brandon Crawford in his second game, or third game technically, because, you know, he played two games in his debut. How about that? Brandon Crawford jumping on a changeup, and we put up a three spot on Jacob DeGrom here in the first. Oh, I read that changeup really well. I just couldn't keep it fair. And he blows me away with a fastball. But home runs from a couple of Giants players. Willie Mays and Brandon Crawford going deep. Giving Garrett Cole a 3 nothing lead. And I just realized something. Brandon Crawford hit a two-run shot to give his brother-in-law a 3 nothing lead. I'm looking for at least five innings out of Cole. If he can do that, I'll be happy with that. And I don't know why he was bunting with Henderson on two strikes. Literally just gave up on that at bat. All right. Parallel five, Kevin Kiermaier. This is an interesting choice to have on your team. Obviously, he has the good defense, but with the hitting stats that he has against someone like on Hall of Fame, like Garrett Cole or DeGrom, very, very interesting. Oh, just missing. Fastball at the knees, low and away, just missing it. All right, ground ball to short. Tatis better hurry. He's got that 99 arm strength, so that kind of helps out. Although, there were a couple instances yesterday where, like, he had, like, a easy chance to get him out, and he just could not throw the ball, in, like, in time. By the averages that he has, he's probably going to rely on his pitching, which has already let him down so far. But it's still early. We still got, what? 25 outs to play with here. He can easy like tie it up with a couple swings. All right, Tucker, he's got it. All right, good start there for Cole. Strikeout, ground ball, fly out. And Tucker got a couple pitches. Fortunately, hit him right at someone. Now I think the fastball is coming. Nope. Another walk. All right. Garrett Cole does have hitting stats. Let's see it. Yeah, 11-32 against righties. Right, took a bunt. All right. Move up to second. Had him on the move. All right. That'll give Willie a shot. That ball's hit well to right field. That ball is deep. That ball is gone. Willie Mays, two at bats in two innings. Man, moving on to the top spot in the lineup has really done wonders. We can get this knuckle curve. Get him swinging in the dirt. Oh, that was a good pitch. It's a good job to take. All right, nice. Got him on that sinker. All right, Hank Aaron. Hit on the ground, ground ball, left. that's going to be a base hit. hit Alright, that's his first hit of the game. Base hit past Tatis and Chipper. Really a rare 
talent in this sport, a true five tool player, as they say, which means he can make an impact. Oh my god, he beat him. Oh, I should have put the tag on him. Does he come back with yet another? Hey, that's back All right, got him. Really good sliders. I All right, Eric Davis. You know what? Looks like he's I'm gonna walk him to get to uh, Degrom. Right I know Degrom can hit, but there. I'd rather have the pitcher up. On second, Davis. Got him. Let's go. All right. So the move works out. Works out for Cole. Oh man! Like there's been a couple pitches in this game already that I've missed. With Tucker, with Soto, now with Chipper. I didn't miss that one. He tried going to back to a fastball, and I did not miss it this time. Goodbye. That was a fastball right down the cookie jar, and we add on. It's six nothing. I missed it. Yeah, missed that one. Uh, oh, that was a hanging curveball. I'm not even on the on the PCI, but that you can't leave pitches like that. Goodbye. Second home run of the inning. All right, second time around here in the lineup. We got Henderson leading it off here against Cole. Ground ball. Oh shit, this might be a little bit tougher. Man, that ball was hit kind of slow. I did a slide step, and he still got it. I should have pitched out better. Why are you bunting? With two strikes? That's the second time he's done that. That's fine. Alright, go back home. I don't know what he's doing, but he just ran himself out of the inning. Swing and a liner. Line drive. That's going to get caught. Ah, uh, that ball didn't sink enough. That ball hung up like a little too long. Oh, wow. I missed it. And for the first time in this game, I'm down in order. It's usually my strikeout pitch like most of the time whenever I you know, go to that. Round ball. Tatis, he's got it. Throw him out. Nice. Good start here for that slider up. Away to a righty. Good take. Pop up. Easy play for Willie. Right. Two out. Got him. Garrett Cole, four shutout innings so far. He is pitching one heck of a game. Fly ball to right. Easy play for Tucker. He's got it. All right, one out. See, I walked Davis to get to DeGrom last time, and it worked out in our favor. And he tried to bunt. He's making some very questionable decisions with this team. Got to get some offense going. Up. Well, it's a 1 2 3 inning. Went back to the slider. Went to the pre, you know, previous pitch. Got me to swing. This time made contact, but it was right at his first baseman. All right, ball four. Second time he's been on base. This time on a walk. He's going to walk him and get to Cole. I drive. Ah, that's going to be caught by Kiermaier. If it was in the gap, I think that would have been at least two runs in because I got good speed out there. All right, what? A couple walks. One intentional. Nothing really much. The fastball just at the knees. Got him. He was not ready for that. I think it was up for something else. Spider. Inside. Try to jam him. And we do that just that. Yeah, that's back-to-back -back strikeouts. So Cole is dominating right now. Got him. Struck out the side. Top of the order. No problems for Cole. I'm not sure where they played at, but yeah. Staples Center has been like the name for like the Lakers and the Kings. And you know, that, now that they're changing it, yeah, I'm, I'm still calling it Staples. Okay, I haven't really done anything on offense since that third inning. Like I've had a couple of chances, like working with the walks, but no runs have been allowed since the third inning. So he's still giving himself a chance to come back, but with the way Garrett Cole is pitching, 
It's going to be tough. I'm not sure whether the judge called because he's pitching well or if this guy's just not really doing well on the offensive side with the bat. That's 11 strikeouts, by the way. Keeping his pitches to a minimum. Got him. Dozen strikeouts for Garrett Cole. And that's seven shutout innings for Garrett Cole so far. And Perez. Oh, my God. I'm not even on that pitch, but that ball is going to be gone. His second home run of the game. And it's gone as they add still another. Salvi is just cracked for me right now. Ground ball. Chipper. Scooped up. All right, nice. Hit it to the only guy out there on the left side. And he was able to get the out. Let's go slider up and away. Let's see if we can get him on this pitch. Nope. I mean, I'm not really tripping. I'm up 8 nothing. Yeah, defensive indifference is on. Runner at second here with one man out. Swing and a miss. Got him. And they'll dodge it's another strikeout for Cole. Two away. All right, let's see if we can try to strand him at third. And now the runner's trying for third. Grounded to short. He's got it. Right, let's throw it first. All right, nice. Lead the runner at third. Eight shutout innings for Cole. He's three outs away from a complete game shutout. Right. Let's see if Cole can finish off this CG. And if he can get to under 100 pitches. All night long. If he can continue spinning it like nice, that's another strikeout. In a box to me tonight. He's been Got him one strike away from a CG. Fly ball, chipper, can he get there? He can, how about that? Garrett Cole, a CG shutout. How about that? Garrett Cole going the full nine innings, getting a shutout. How many strikeouts did he have? He had, where are the strikeouts? 15 strikeouts. He was dominant from the get-go. I'm going to wrap it up here for Garrett Cole's debut. Um, I'm still going to do more. Like, I might get Zach Wheeler. I might get Marcus Stroman to do debuts with them. And then for the offense, maybe we'll get Max Muncy. Wait, maybe. I am going to get Max Muncy. What am I talking about? I'm going to do a debut with him. And, uh, yeah, more debuts just coming. But uh, I'm going to wrap it up. If you guys enjoyed, hit that like button. Subscribe if you are new. My last couple videos are up on the screen, which is the Crawford debut, and then I'll put another video up on the screen, whether it's Burns or Tucker, but I'm going to wrap it up. Hit that like button if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you were new. I'll leave my Twitch link in the description, and yeah, I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out, everyone.